feels so good to have jeans on and that's something I wasn't sure if I would be saying or not. I am three going on four weeks postpartum. I've obviously missed tremendously being able to wear jeans, especially my Abercrombie jeans because they are my favorite. Um, and I decided to give them a try last week to see if I could even get them on if I felt good. And lo and behold, I did. I had two pairs of um, size 26s from when I was pregnant in like my second trimester and those fit. I tried on my size 25s, they weren't fitting. That's my pre-pregnancy size, but we are in a 26. I feel really great in these and I picked up some new styles in this size. So let's do a haul. These are the 90s high rise relax jean. This is one of my favorite styles and I really like this wash. I would call this a medium wash in my opinion. I don't remember the exact name, but the wash I think is really good. Easy to style, easy to wear. Um, I've always loved this high rise uh, fit in the waist. And then in the leg, it's just like the name says, that relaxed fit. And I think these are just perfect casual sneaker wearing jeans. Easy to pair with a little t-shirt, tank top. I, if you know, just like casual outfits. So something like this with sneakers, baby tee, a little trucker hat is a go-to outfit of mine. I feel really good in this. Um, they have a thousand different washes and styles in this fit. And these have a little bit of stretch to them. They're not super stretchy, but they're also not very rigid. Um, definitely really comfy. I like that they are fitted through the butt and then obviously have that relaxed fit uh, down the leg. This next pair is the Ultra High Rise Ankle Straight. This used to be one of my favorite fits and I still love it. I would say I don't wear it quite as often, but I love this style and I really love having a cropped length um, in my wardrobe because I do tend to wear it a lot. I do like this with um, sneakers. I like this length uh, with ankle boots in the fall and like different winter shoes too. Um, and I just think they're really cute. They're definitely different than like the baggier 90s jeans that have become very popular. Uh, but these have always been really flattering, really comfortable. These are in a light wash. Um, they say ultra high, ultra high rise, but I personally feel like they're around the same uh, in terms of where they hit on the waist compared to the last pair. Uh, but I always... I mean, especially now that I'm not pregnant, I prefer a high-waisted. Um, so these are comfy, they're flattering. These are more on the rigid side, in my opinion. They don't have quite as much stretch. And these are in a 26 short. They're actually in Curve Love though, um, which if you remember pre-pregnancy, I would typically size down in Curve Love because I'm not very curvy, but I didn't do that this time just because I'm postpartum, like I'm just not back to my pre-pregnancy size. Um, so these are a 26 short in curve love. Um, they fit great in the waist. I definitely couldn't have sized down like I used to do and do a, um, gosh, well, I guess pre-pregnancy, I would have been a 24, uh, short in curve love. Definitely couldn't do that. I couldn't even do a 25 in these. And I'm only sharing to give context and reference to my size. I personally find it helpful when someone's doing a try on haul to share their sizing and if anything has changed. So that's, truly the only reason why I'm sharing. Um, but these are just like a tad looser in the leg than what they typically would have been on me pre-pregnancy if I did my normal pre-pregnancy size. I hope that makes sense. So they fit great in the waist. They fit great in the leg too. They just are a tad um, looser, like less fitted than what they normally would have been had I done my normal sizing. But I like the way they fit. They're so comfortable. I haven't really been doing a ton of tight things anyways at this point, especially not on my stomach, like not in this area, not on my leg. So I like the fit of these a lot. They're honestly kind of giving like a mom jean fit, um, in my opinion, which I think is cute. So love them style like this, just a really easy, simple, casual outfit. Um, but come winter, fall, love these jeans styled with sweaters, with bodysuits, with different layers, and like a cute ankle boot. 
that really just accentuates the cropped length. Okay, these make me so happy. I feel really good in them. And historically, this is my favorite fit um, and style of the Abercrombie jeans. These are the ultra high rise 90s straight jeans. So these are a little less baggy um, at the ends than the relaxed fit, which I feel like makes sense, right? One says 90s straight, the other is 90s relaxed. So I like the 90s straight. Um, it just is more my style. I think it is more flattering for the kind of outfits that I like to wear, how I like to dress, um, and my body type. I don't know. I just like it better and I feel cute in these. Like I feel my absolute best in this style and fit and I love them with my Converse platform, which are one of my favorite sneakers ever. So I really, really like the cut and fit of these jeans with these sneakers. It just works. They also look cute with other shoes too, but I really love wearing these two together. So um, these are in a 26 short. I'm pretty sure every pair that I have is in a 26 short. Um, and this wash I think is so much fun. It's just so different because I don't have anything else like it. You know, everything else is a true like denim shade, but these are in the uh, oat color and it is like a beigey tan. I think it's just so much fun. I did own these previously, so I've definitely shared these before. Um, they're just in a 25, so they don't fit right now. I really wanted to have these for now and for fall. Um, so I didn't wanna wait. I went ahead and just snagged them in this size too, so I could go ahead and wear them. But I think it's a fun neutral to have. I got a lot of use out of them when I bought these last year. Um, I love them paired with other neutrals. They look so cute with navy too, different greens, things like that. And these, I just love the fit through the butt, the waist, the leg, everything about them is just perfection. I love, love, love these. So this is hands down my favorite fit, my favorite style. And again, it's the ultra high rise 90s straight jean. These are same, same, just a different wash. These are in stone, so I love this wash as well. They're another like really nice neutral. Um, obviously my shirt is white, so you can see these are between the last shade that I had on, the oat, and then like a white. Um, so I just love having this shade because it mixes it up. It's not a stark white. I feel like this is still very wearable um, for end of summer going into fall and then actual fall weather as well. And of course they're in my favorite style and fit. So these are the ultra high rise 90 straight. I'm wearing them in a 26 short and they are literally the same exact as the last pair, just a different wash. And I had these last year, once again, got a lot of wear out of them. They looked so cute with navies, with greens. I loved styling these uh, with different olive tops and accessories and stuff. It just helped to break up some of my outfits. It's a nice light neutral. It's obviously not white, but it's something different. It just keeps it light neutral. I feel like it keeps outfits fresh, breaks up the denim, breaks up, you know, black bottoms and pants. And I just think these are so cute. So these are in stone. Last ones were in oat and I love having these in my closet. Once again, same, same, but different. I told you guys, I really do have a thing for this fit ultra high rise 90 straight. Um, this by far, hands down, is my most worn jean and my most worn wash. This is in the light wash. I don't know what it is about this, but I feel like they look worn in. They just look effortless. I'm really drawn to it. I grab for these nonstop all the time. If I could only have one pair of jeans in my closet, it would be these. I absolutely love these. Um, I have these in a 26 short. What I've also done in the past and forgot about, and honestly, we'll probably go back and do because they're still on sale until tomorrow. I don't know that they will be when the by the time this video goes live, but for me right now, <laughs> they're on sale. Um, I like getting an extra short in these two because it makes them just slightly more cropped and they hit at the perfect place for these sneakers to wear with heels, to wear with booties, like to wear with literally any shoe. So I do like it in the regular short option, which is what I have on right now, but I also love, love, love these in the extra short option, which just makes them a little bit more cropped and universal, I feel like, for every single shoe. Um, so love the fit of these so much. This wash, I don't know what they did, but it's perfection. I just absolutely love it. Again, I feel like it looks slightly worn in. It just has like a 
cool, effortless 90s feel to it. Um, these have a little bit of stretch to them. They are so incredibly comfortable. They're just chef's kiss. Everything about these, I absolutely love. So if there's one pair of denim out of all the denim that I'm sharing with you all that I would recommend, it's these. Obviously haven't been posting a lot of denim because I've been pregnant for the past nine months. But if you were to go to my LTK and look at any of my denim outfits that I share or just type in Abercrombie in the search bar and look at my Abercrombie outfits, these are gonna be the most worn that you'll see on my page. Um, it's just likely in the extra short option. I'll be so honest, I didn't know if I was gonna like these. I'm like the pickiest when it comes to darker wash jeans. So like black denim and then true dark wash denim. Um, I don't know what it is, but there's something about the fit that throws me off sometimes. These are surprisingly um, also the ultra high rise 90 street jean, but I feel like these fit a little bit more like a dad jean. They remind me of a pair of the dad style denim that I have from a few years ago, but they're distressed. Um, and these obviously aren't. They're just like a fresh straight leg. Um, and I actually really like it. They are a little bit baggier through the leg, which it might be hard to tell since they are so dark, but they fit really well in the waist. They are a little tight on the butt until like here, and then they just start to get a little bit baggier and more relaxed, and I think they're really cute. I do. I like them with my Converse. I did try them on with my Adidas on Bays, and I didn't like them. I just don't like the way that it looks at all um, at the bottom of the leg. It's just, it's not for me. But I do like how they are fitting with the Converse's, especially because they are tight at the, the jeans are tight at the waist and then just a little bit more baggy and relaxed through the leg. So these are pretty cute. They're actually quite comfortable too, which I like. I don't know about you guys, but in the past I've had experiences with um, black wash denim where they're just so stiff and rigid and then just don't end up being flattering. But these, I feel like, fit really well. They're flattering. I really like the fit a lot. I think this style for me, too, would be cute with heels. I would pair this, and I would like this with heels. It is interesting how they're the same style, but I just feel like they're a smidge longer than the other ones, and they're the exact same size as the other uh, 90 straight jean. And like I mentioned, they're just like a little bit baggier um, in the leg. But... Very cute. I think these will be fun for fall. I also have my black Converse, so I think that will be cute uh, with these jeans as well. And I'll have to just play around with some of my other sneakers, see what I like. With a jean like this, I definitely see myself wearing it with a cropped top like I'm wearing now, like a tight uh, cropped tank top or baby tee like this, or a tight fitting um, bodysuit. And I think it would be really cute layered with like maybe a flannel, something like that, just for like an easy, casual, relaxed, everyday look. Very much my vibe, very much my style. But I'm glad I got these. Definitely glad that I'm sharing them and trying them on since they are, like I mentioned, in the same family as the other, I mean, the last three jeans that I've put on. But I feel like the fit is just a little bit different. These are so cute though. But that is all the jeans that I had. I had six pairs to share with you guys. So I hope you all enjoyed seeing them. I'm excited for my most recent Abercrombie order to come in that I, I just placed like yesterday. So I will have that soon. Um, and of course we'll do a try on haul and we'll share, but excited to get back into the hauls and outfits and styling. Uh, I'm still kind of stuck in summer. I'm not ready to transition to fall, but I am I'm looking forward to doing fall outfits soon. Just not right this moment. <laughs> Let me know what you're shopping for though. Let me know if you're in the fall mood already. I'm sure most of you are. I'm just trying to hang on to summer since I was pregnant for so much of summer. I'm trying to live it up a little bit now that I'm not. But you guys already know, everything will be linked down below in the description box. Let me know if you have any questions on sizing. I'll try to be as helpful as I can. Love you guys so much and until next time.